Welcome. In front of me I have Garmin Phoenix 8 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Basically if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with your iPhone via the Garmin Connect application. And once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now uh, we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed for the Garmin app and your iPhone to send the notifications to your watch. So what we need to do is to open the settings on our iPhone. So find the settings icon and tap on it. In settings, we need to find the Bluetooth option. And once you find it, tap on it. And here on the list of my devices, you should see Phoenix 8. Tap on the info icon next to it. And right here, you should see this option called share system notifications. And this option needs to be enabled for the notifications to work. If you don't see this option, uh, you need to close the settings for now. Open the Garmin Connect application on your iPhone. Tap on more. Find the Garmin devices and tap on them. And here, select your Phoenix 8. Now, uh, tap on this icon right here, the sync icon to sync the devices together. Wait a couple of seconds and you may see, and you may see some pop-ups about some permissions or the pairing even. So if you see the pairing pop-up, tap on pair. If you're seeing the, if seeing the permission per pop-up like something about the notifications, tap on allow. If you don't see the pop-up about the notifications, you can also tap on notification and alerts, uh, smart notifications, uh, turn on the notifications right here, make sure it's turned on, and then resync the devices and wait a couple of seconds and you should see some pop-ups. And once you're done with the uh, pairing and the um, permissions for the notifications, you can close the app and go back to settings and just make sure that the option is there. So Bluetooth, info icon, and it should be here and it needs to be enabled. So make sure it is enabled. Then go back to the main page of settings, scroll down and find the connect application on the list and tap on it. And here make sure that the Bluetooth option is also enabled. Once it is, close the settings and reopen the Garmin Connect app. And the application uh, Tap on more to open the menu, scroll down, select your Garmin devices option, and then I tap on the Phoenix 8 to open the settings page for your watch. Now, scroll down, tap on notifications and alerts, and then tap on smart notifications. If they're turned off, turn them on by tapping on on, and here we have three types of notifications. We have calls, texts, and apps, and we can customize the settings for them. We can tap on calls, for example, and we can turn on or off the notifications for the calls as the whole. We can also enable or disable the sound and vibration for them. And we can do the same thing for the texts and the apps. And below the notifications uh, types, we have privacy option. This allows you to select press start or gesture. If you select press start, you will need to press the start button, this one right here, to reveal the notification uh, content because it's gonna be hidden and next we have the gesture so you will need to perform the wrist gesture to reveal it of course if off is selected this option is disabled and next we have the timeout option and it basically means how long the notification stays on the screen after you receive it and you have 30 seconds one minute and three minutes select the one you like of course and last option is the signature you can enable it or disable it Okay, and once you're done uh, setting up your notifications, you should be able to receive them. So I'm gonna open Discord and see if I'm logged in. I am. So I'm gonna send myself a message on Discord. As you can see, we got it on our iPhone and we also got it on our watch. And if you miss the notification on your watch, you can always swipe down from the top of the screen on the home screen to open the notification uh, panel. And that's how you enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. 
Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving a like on the video.